So lately, Amazon has really been cracking down on especially your first three videos as an Amazon influencer in order to get that on-site commission unlocked. This is the key. This is where the big money happens. So of course you want to make sure that you get unlocked for on-site commission. But I keep hearing of all these people that are getting denied. And so I created this video with the top three reasons that I keep hearing and that I, from my observations and my experience in the Amazon influencer program over the last two years, these are the top three reasons that your videos are probably getting rejected from the Amazon influencer program. Make sure you stick around and listen to number three, because I think that is the most common one. And a lot of people, especially the newbie Amazon influencers really don't understand that they shouldn't be doing this. So number one, one of the most common reasons why your video could be getting rejected from the influencer program is that you are saying words that Amazon doesn't like. So what do I mean by that? Think of claims. Think of health and wellness products. If you have supplements or diapers or medicine or things like that, you have to be really, really careful what you're saying in your video. As a seller, I know all of the top keywords to not use in your Amazon product listing. So I've translated that into also not using those particular words in my Amazon videos. Some examples would be talking about a cure for something. One specific example that I can think of was I created a video. We had a goldfish. My kids got a goldfish for the last day of school from one of their teachers. And this goldfish was amazing. He survived so much longer than we thought. He made it through the whole summer. And right at the end of the summer there, you know, we were like, oh, there's something going on with his head. He had this kind of red stuff on his head. So, you know, we Googled it. We tried to figure out how can we help this amazing goldfish who has lasted this long. So we Googled it and it what came up was it seemed like a bacterial infection for a goldfish, which I really have no experience with that. So what did I do? I went to Amazon. Of course, I went to Amazon and I searched for whatever kind of medicine or whatever kind of product would cure this bacterial infection in my goldfish. Okay, so I bought the item, used it, it totally cleared it up. It was like actually very amazing. I would highly recommend this product. <laughs> it worked like a charm. But when it was all over, I was like, this was such a great product. I have to make sure that I create a video for it. Well, the very first video that I did definitely got rejected because I said things like the fish had a bacterial infection and this product seemed to cure it. Okay. So those are all the red flag things that I really should have known. I really should have known not to do that, but I thought, you know, it's like a medicine. So maybe Amazon will let it slide. Um, and they did not. So then the video got rejected. I went back and I removed everything every time I said infection or bacteria or cure. And I just kind of made it a little bit more generic. And I said, you know, the fish was sick and this product really helped him get back to the state that he was in before he was sick. Okay. So there's an example of how you can kind of reframe what you're saying in order to get Amazon to approve those videos when you're talking about health and wellness products. Okay. So that's number one, make sure you're not making claims, talking about things that Amazon doesn't want you to talk about. Number two, bad quality of video. And what do I mean by that? This could be bad lighting in your video. It could be bad audio quality where someone has to turn the volume all the way up in order to hear your audio, or it could be that there's static in the audio or there's background noise. So those two things are very common and Amazon is really getting, uh, they're really cracking down more on these two things. They want good quality videos. And while we do see some garbage videos out there, of course, there's always garbage videos out there from some influencers, not you or me though, right? But this is one of the top reasons why I'm seeing, you know, some of my students are coming back with, well, I got rejected and then they send me the videos and I'm like, well, the lighting was terrible or I, you know, I can't hear you very well. And that's why. So this is very, very much something that I teach in my course influence and earn is how do you make a good quality video that will always get approved by Amazon? So make sure you have good lighting and good audio. All right, number three, this is the big one. This is the one that I see people get rejected all the time with their videos, whether it's your first three or it's your 1,584th video. It is very, very common that Amazon tells us your video was rejected because you have disclosed personal or private information. 
This is such a big, generic way reasoning for rejection. So I want to explain to you a little bit more what these items could actually be. So one of the biggest things is, do you, are you including a shipping label? This is something that maybe you're not looking at, but if you have a shipping label or another really big one is the barcode. If there's a barcode or a shipping label on the product box or on the product anywhere within your video, Amazon will not approve that video. They don't want people to know your address, obviously, but the barcode one is a very big one too. They don't want barcodes in the videos. They will reject that each and every time. So if you say, you know, I didn't disclose any private information, I know I didn't, make sure that you check the boxes. There's no barcodes in anything. This includes packaging, right? I have people that I see and, you know, videos that I review before they submit them to Amazon and they're showing the packaging and then they quickly flip it over real quick. And then there's the barcode there, or there's the QR code. And then they flip it back over because they just want to show, right? And that's something that we should be doing is showing the product, of course. But if you're showing the product and you see the barcode or even the QR code, that very much is a reason that Amazon could be rejecting your videos. Another thing you want to look out for is that if you are actually disclosing personal or private information, I had a video that was rejected after it was after it was initially approved. It got rejected after the fact because I had accidentally shown one of the street signs in the background because I was filming, you know, outside of my house. And so again, you know, I didn't catch it. Thanks Amazon for catching it. I don't want people to know where I live either, right? So that's another big one is this personal private information, but this does include barcodes and QR codes on any sort of packaging from these products that you're creating videos for. So those are the top three reasons that your video might be getting rejected from the Amazon influencer program. Let's review real quick. Number one, words that Amazon doesn't like, like bacteria, infection, or claiming to cure something, or really kind of anything in between there. Stay away from that, especially if you're looking at health and wellness products. Number two is just bad quality video. That could be audio, that could be the video, and anything in between. If it's not good quality, Amazon doesn't want it on their platform. Yes, sometimes it gets through, but especially for your first three videos, it's almost never going to work that way. And finally, number three is the personal or private information being disclosed that you may not even know has been disclosed, which could be a shipping label from a box that you received that happened to be in the video, or it could even be just a barcode on the package of the item that you're showing within your video. So if you found this video helpful, I would love if you would go ahead and click the subscribe button so you will be alerted every single week when I release a brand new video with tips, tricks, and strategies on how to earn more with the Amazon Influencer Program. And if you found this video helpful and you want to be able to earn $10,000 a month and more, please go ahead and sign up for my free masterclass at smartbusinessmom.com slash masterclass, where I walk you through my five-step system that took me from zero all the way to earning six figures just with the Amazon Influencer Program every single year for the past two years. So sign up for that free masterclass, smartbusinessmom.com slash masterclass, so that you can learn very quickly how to increase your Amazon Influencer earnings. And until then, I'll see you in the next video.